First of all, the good things. It's pretty easy to change the spray pattern. You just rotate this little flange on the front of the unit. It's also easy to change the siphon tube. So for example, if you're pointing it up, you want the siphon tube to be rotated to the back. This was very simple. My set came with five additional nozzles and it's pretty easy to switch them out. They provide a little wrench and you simply undo one nozzle and you put the next one in. Here's an example where the unit excels. You see these narrow strips such as in a corner or an angle? This is where the unit does very well. There are three big issues with this sprayer. First of all, it's very noisy. You're going to have to wear ear protection. Secondly, it's quite heavy. My arm really got tired after a while. But worst of all, notice that the strip of paint that it's spraying is very narrow. That is, it's good for a small, narrow area, but if you're going to paint an entire wall, it's really not very good. Well, the unit is pretty inexpensive and it's easy to use, but honestly, it's only good for very light-duty small projects. I hope you enjoyed this video. In Dublin, California, I'm Basso Contour. Thanks for watching, everybody.